That scared the crap out of me. <laughs> Somebody told me that Menards has their Halloween stuff in, so we are gonna go in there right now and check it out. Oh, I see it. It is set up right up here. Here we go, guys. I am so excited. Look at these inflatables and everything. Yes, sweet. This whole section around here, we got inflatables up here, and then some things over on the other side, some animatronics. Let's take a look at these things. Look at this dino first. <laughs> inflatable dino going trick-or-treating <laughs> he's got the pumpkin Halloween trick-or-treating bag we got a five foot clown with balloons that's more like a fun fun balloon or I mean a fun clown I can't even talk I do like his balloons though I like I like the colors the orange and the green how they're just kind of like that classic looking Halloween and then check this out we got a jack-o-lantern that's not a blow mold that's an inflatable. Blow mold is like a hard plastic. Okay, what do we got here? We got a Frankenstein. He's pretty cool, I like his big head. That's probably about four feet tall, I would have to say. That's pretty cool, here's another pumpkin. There was some kid complained because I called them pumpkies. It's a pumpkin. Hey kid, guess what? It's a pumpkin. <laughs> oh look, it's got a ghoul inside, a skeleton. That's pretty cool. I totally did not expect that to hop out. Okay, are you going back down? That's weird. I wonder if it was motion activated or something because there he goes. Now he's going back down. Okay, there he goes. Bye, skeleton in the pumpkin. We got the pink ugly dolls. That's actually pretty cool. I don't know what an ugly doll is except for an ugly doll, but four foot Halloween character. This one's only 20 bucks. I like that. I love the classic Halloween look. I think that's supposed to be a bat, but it's green, but that's cool. And look at this, we have a giant green serpent up here. He actually snakes around and there's his tail coming down the back. And here he is right here. He fogs too. Look, you can see this little black thing inside his mouth there. That's where the fog shoots out. That is pretty awesome. I'd love to see that in action. We'll move over to the other side in a minute to see an animatronic, but they got a lot more inflatables down here, so let's check those out first. Okay, this one is set up. We just saw that. Here's a sweet little mummy. That one was not blown up. I like that one. That's cool. We got a vampire and a witch. Here's the pink ugly doll, and then they also have green ones. I don't know if there's more different ones throughout there. Yeah, it looks like they just have the pink and green ones, but those are pretty cool. Here's our pop-up uh, skeleton coming out of the pumpkin. Uh, that's all that is back there. Oh, look, we got uh, inflatable Sally and Jack Skellington from Nightmare Before Christmas. Those are really cool. Someone needs to tell me to keep an eye out for those. What is that? Sally is 30 bucks, and Jack is 65 Here's our clown with balloons. What is that? It's lighted truck. Oh, that's kind of like the thing at Christmas that... The red truck that has the Christmas tree, but this one has pumpkins. Trick or treat, happy Halloween hat. Witch hat, not working, okay. Happy Halloween, flashing skeleton. Like I said guys, I love this classic Halloween stuff. Look at those bats, I love that. It's like, it's fun, it's friendly, and it's kind of spooky. Here we got the big lighted eyes that go on your door or in your yard. Those are cool. Oh yes, we got a spooky tree, guys. I love the spooky tree. That's probably always my favorite inflatable, is a spooky tree. <laughs> and look, this one's got an owl. It's got a ghost and two pumpkins down there. I love that, that's really cool. That's nine feet tall, too. There's our serpent. Here's our skeleton raptor. That's the one we were looking at down at the end here when we first started. He's going trick-or-treating with his skeleton raptor friends. Oh look, we got a fire and ice back here. What is that? Giant fire and ice reaper. That's pretty cool. That's the kind where the skull, like the lights all move around in there instead of just lighting up solid. Here's a skeleton reaper, eight feet tall. That's pretty cool. Here's a different Frankenstein than what we saw. This is the other one that we did see already inflated. And there's another uh, Frankenstein. Air balloon dragon. 
Yeah, that's all the ones that are inflated on the top there. Let's go around the side here. This is cool. Look, we got Oogie Boogie. 15 bucks for him. Light up Sally head. See, this is more like a, uh, what's it called? A blow mold. See, it's plastic. It's hard. It doesn't deflate. Ooh, try me. Yes, it works. Check it out. Cool. Oh, this is cool. Little light up pumpkins. The characters from, uh, Nightmare Before Christmas. That's cool. <laughs> I love those. That makes me want to go home and watch the show so bad. I think I'm going to have to watch it tonight. What is this? Dancing Flame Pumpkin Speaker. Okay, so it's a pumpkin that is a speaker. That's pretty cool. Halloween Party in a Box. And apparently it flashes or something too. As if it's on fire, I guess. Look at this display they have up here. That's pretty cool. I like that. I love how they put the time into making that, and I think those webs, green and orange, are actually like black light reactive. Those are so cool. And that's just made with simple stuff too. The hanging ghosts, and uh, you know, this little string of ghosts up here, a couple of skulls, spider webs. You could easily do that on your front porch. It wouldn't be too expensive and it would be totally awesome. In fact, here's the skulls that they're using up there, $12.99 each. That's a porch light cover. That would be really cool. What is this? Holiday video decorating kit. I don't think that comes with it. I could be wrong. Maybe it does. Huh. Yeah, I guess it does. It includes the projector. And you project the pictures up onto your house. That's pretty cool. Look at this. 45 bucks. It was 89 It's only 45 now. That is a deal, guys, with the projector coming with it. Here's these shadow lights. I love these. Look at that. That's so cool solar landscape lights look at that that's cool haunted house black cat cemetery oh this is cool i remember this from last year high voltage box look at that <laughs> that's awesome the animatronics are right behind us guys we'll get there in just a minute i'm having too much fun looking at this stuff lead spooky eyes lantern oh look at that <laughs> I love how he shakes around like he's stuck in there trying to get out. Another porch light cover. Spooky uh, pumpkin. I like that. That's cool. Lots of different kinds of projectors here. Here's witches. Here's ghosts. Cascading projection. Looks like a spider web with spiders. Light up bats with a moon behind it. I think I remember this from last year. That's pretty cool. That would look awesome in the dark. Day of the Dead string lights. Those are cool. Oh, these are awesome. Infinity mirrors. Look, a pumpkin, a ghost. Oh, look, we got a couple more inflatables over here, too. Look, tombstone scene. That's pretty cool. Look, he loved bacon. <laughs> Hole in one, dead Fred, Phil Dirt, Ben Better. That's pretty cool. I like that. We got the pumpkin family. Pumpkin patch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven pumpkins in that one. Eight feet wide. Here's different colors of pumpkin patch. Ooh, I like this one a lot, guys. Check that out. Eight feet wide. That's awesome. I love the spider. That's cool. Look, we got an inflatable ghost family, too. That's cool. Look, she's got a bow in her hair. What the heck? Inflatable reaper. Inflatable ghost. Okay. Jack Skellington pumpkin, and he lights up. Let's try this. Yeah, I love it. A little inflatable pumpkin stack. That's cool. I like the ones that are multicolored, though. Here's some circle ghosts. Those kind of look multicolored. I wonder if they, like, change colors or something. Yeah, color-changing LED lights. That's cool. I like those. Ooh, I remember this from last year. This is awesome. Three cackling witches around the cauldron. Lanky werewolf. <laughs> I like that guy too. Five three, five feet three inches tall. Here we got uh, Jack Skellington. Pumpkin with disco lights. I guess that's an inflatable. Okay, yeah, that's an inflatable, and it's got those swirling lights on the inside. That's really cool. I like those. Dark Countess. She looks creepy. Five and a half feet tall. Animated hanging surprise scarecrow. Oh, I see his head is down and then he jumps up at you. I wish they had that one set up. I'd like to see that. And here's our animatronics, guys. Okay, let's check out Jack Skellington first. Okay, I can't figure out how to get him going. Oh, there he goes. When he's talking, he sounds cool. Hold on, let's do it again. All right, here he goes. Watch his mouth. 
you can't hear what he's saying from down here, but you can see his mouth moving. That looks really cool. I like that. It doesn't last very long, though, whatever he's saying. He just says it real quick, and then he's done. All right, let's check out Pennywise here. Here we go. Did you miss me? Ah. He's loud, too. Check it out. Ah, oh, come on. Do more than that. Where are you going yet? Yeah, you can't really hear what he's saying, but... I like how his eyes light up and how the balloon goes up and down. Yeah, with the music so loud in here, you can't hear what these guys are saying because they're so far away, I can't even get any closer to them. And one more time before the next song comes on. There you go. All right, let's check out the witch here. I can't get her to do anything, and there's not a uh, button or anything that I see. That's a bummer. I'd love to see her in action flying on the broom. <laughs> Alright, let's see what this one is. This is the Countess. There she goes. Well, she didn't do a whole lot. Her eyes lit up and that was about it. Here's our Grim Reaper. Check him out. He's pretty cool. I do wish he was sitting down here, though, so we could get a better look at him. I'll definitely be going to another Menards to see if these are set up on the floor where we can actually get a really good look at them. But they're pretty cool. I mean, from what I can see, you just can't hear them because they're so far away. And there's this guy, and I can't get him to do anything either. So I don't know if they're supposed to be, like, buttons or what, but he looks cool. Okay, that one's not working either. It looks like the top pops off and a ghoul comes out from behind. Unless this is all, this must all be the same thing here. Oh, look at this awesome witch face. I remember this from last year. These are like a felt material. I love those. I love how bold the colors are on those. Right, let's go around the corner here and see if there's anything else we're missing. There's some more stuff right over here though. Okay, we got like the typical pumpkin signs, pumpkin patch, hocus pocus that one says. Zombie feeding area, <laughs> that's foam. Little scarecrows, a little bit bigger scarecrows, just things you stick in your front yard. That's cool with the ghost right there, this way if you dare. I like that. Oh, this is cool, they have like these accent pillows. Black cat, whoops. And this one, I really like this one. <laughs> yeah, this stuff down here is more just like the basic home decor if you don't wanna do anything really spooky but you wanna have a little bit of a Halloween in your house anyway. Little monsters live here. Spider elixir. Uncle Spooky's potion. <laughs> Witch's ball. Whoops, I pulled that thing out. But I see a wire in there. I guess it's supposed to light up. It is boo, y'all. Our home has good bones. Come in for a bite. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> Oh, here's all our everything's bones. Last year, like, there was a ton of this stuff that was just all bones. Look, we got spider bones, rat bones. What is this? A skeleton snake, a pig, an owl, maybe? Dragons, posable dog. Some of them have try me buttons. Ooh, evil skeleton dog. Okay. This looks like a giant skull head on canvas. Raven in cage. <laughs> Don't be afraid. People say I'm crazy. <laughs> People say I'm crazy. Animated gargoyle. Oh, that's pretty cool. Who goes there? Oh, he jumps at you. I like that. That's pretty cool. Ooh, there's even a wolf in the background howling. Okay, we got the coffin sound box. That was spooky. Wind. I like that one. That is pretty cool. I wonder how much that is. Six bucks for that. 
I really like that, man. Look, we have Halloween doorbells. Here's a skeleton. Oh, that scared the crap out of me. <laughs> Okay, let's watch that again. Watch, like his tongue or something jumps out. <laughs> oh, no, it's a spider. I think it was a spider on a tongue. That scared me. Okay, and then we got this one. I'm not sure what it's supposed to be, but... Oh, crap, he's not working. There's more, though. Let's try this one. Okay. Yeah. I didn't understand a word he said, but... Okay. Still didn't understand the word he said, but here's a pumpkin too. Oh crap, he's not working. Hold on. There's another one. Sometimes there's, oh yeah, there's a little tab you gotta pull out. Hold on, here we go. <laughs> if you guys could understand a word any of these things said, tell me in the comments below. People around here are probably getting so mad at me because I'm pushing every button on everything. Speaking of pushing buttons, what is this? Zombie alarm. Lights flash with message. Okay, let's see. Where's... Oh, he's got a button. Hold on. Here we go. Get in trouble for inciting panic in here with that one. Alright, let's see what this guy here does. What the heck? <laughs> He's like eating. I guess this is supposed to be a skeleton cookie. Something like that. Listen to him. <laughs> Try this one here. He's got a brain. Yeah, apparently he's a zombie eating a brain. Rocking chair skeleton. Oh! <laughs> the witch probably does the same thing. Get away! Stay away! Get away! Stay away! Here's one of those dropping spiders. You hang it up by that thing and it's sound activated. Somebody walks by and the spider drops on them. Here's a big scarecrow. Ooh, he's soft. This looks like party aisle here. Ooh, zombie crossing sign. All kinds of pumpkin carving stuff here. This is stickers. Instead of carving, you put the stickers on your pumpkin. Jack attack pattern collection. You put the patterns on there and you carve your pumpkins from the patterns. Jack-o'-lantern hacky sacks. That's cool. Little pumpkies. Eyeballs in a glittery ball, I guess. <laughs> Here's a bunch of cool little party favors. Look at this. Neon uh, pumpkin balls. Activity pads. Here's more eyeballs inside a ball. I think you throw these at the wall and they stick because they feel smashy. Bendy skeletons. That's cool. Here's other little bendy guys, I think. Yeah. Spider rings. Here's little ducks. Halloween ducks for the bathtub. Ooh, here's a, oh, it's a, like a mummy. <laughs> That's cool, I like that one. Jack-o'-lantern hoppers. I don't remember exactly how these work, but let's try it. Okay, I guess you just fold it up like that and wait. Oh, there. <laughs> we have the little chattering teeth, like on the Goonies. Witch's broom pen. It's the Nimbus 2000. Ooh, squeezy heads. Little wind-up ghosties. Wind-up pumpkies. Martian fingers, what the heck? <laughs> oh, this is kind of cool. Alien slime test tubes. That's awesome. Ooh, squishy pumpkins. Egg o skulls. Egg o pumpkins. Oh my gosh, guys, look. This one actually even says bag o skulls. <laughs> Here's all our hanging stuff like we were talking about up here in that display. Here's a full size, well, it's a five foot posable skeleton. That's only 50 bucks. These are usually about a hundred bucks other places. Hay bales, a witch's cauldron. 
And here's a giant plush zero. You guys know I love zero. And here's all the spooky town stuff. This stuff is so awesome. I remember looking at this last year. Let's just start down here. Here's the gate. Oh, look, you change the numbers for how many days it's till uh, Halloween. Here's witches that go around in a circle. Uh, I don't see a button or anything to turn them on. Look, skeletons getting married in the cemetery. <laughs> this is pretty cool. Nightmare novelties and it lights up. Oh, look at the camper back here. I like that. That's cool with the little pumpkins around there. Haunted, well, it's a funeral home back there. I guess I thought it was a haunted house. Here's a haunted house. Now that is cool. I like that. Here's another Days Till Halloween thing. A whole trailer or whatever you call it, full of pumpkins. Oh, i oh, Garden of Eaton. <laughs> Look, guys, yeah, it's the Venus fly traps. Look at that. That's hilarious. And this one back here has a bell ringing in it, like a bell tower. Oh, look at this. The cursed cuckoo clock. <laughs> it's Grim Reapers. Oh my gosh. All right, terribly twisted taffy works. Must be a candy shop. The ghoulish gourd pub and grill. Look at these pumpkins up here. <laughs> The Creatures, Custom Hot Rods. Look at this guy. Dang, that reminds me of like the Garbage Pail Kids. Dead Zone Construction. Look at the guy hanging on the hook over here. What the heck? Okay, a little Happy Halloween house. Costume shop. Look at this one back here. A Halloween train. And this is my favorite right here, the Tilt-A-Hurl. Look at this. Look at these people inside the pumpkins. That is too funny. I remember riding the Tilt-A-Whirl at the street fair one time and it did make me puke. I felt so sick afterwards. Oh look, we got Pit and the Pendulum back here too. That is pretty awesome. Let's see if this lights up, yep. How about this one? Yep. Here's another one. Oh, we saw this one over there. Pretty cool, guys. I love all that stuff. Especially the Tilt-A-Hurl. That's my favorite. All right, guys, I think we've pretty much seen everything. There's some inflatables up here that they have set up. Let me just show you. Zoom in on these. These are all ones that we saw uh, when we first came in, actually, in the boxes over there. There's the spooky tree. I think that's pretty much it, besides just tiny little bits and pieces of things, banners and stuff a pumpkin and stuff like that. Pretty cool though, that, this was a really fun trip.